Why do you care about Stormfall anyhow? I don't know. We've been told our whole life that we were the shields of the Unseen. That our purpose was to defend mankind against the supernatural. And now that the city's on the fringe of destruction due to the Covenant of the Blind's actions, I should just let them down, even if I do have the power to do something about it? You still think like a purifier, I see. Why not? I've thought a lot about this. The Republic might be ignorant and wrong about a great many things, but the core cool values Hemlock and the Purifiers gave us are still worth something. Pitting your own family members against one another, abandoning your children. Yeah, those surely are great values to worship. Hemlock might have his reasons. We don't know. Ha! <laughs> I'm sure he does. Wait! Not sure he deserves the opportunity to. Get down! Elastic trash! Ha uh, ha. Uh, I wouldn't if I were you. Oh, God damn it! <laughs> Come on. The Fugitive and the Demon Worshipper. Time to end their heresy. Father? Silence! Why didn't you leave when I told you to? You pitted Edric against his own brother. This filth deserves neither honor nor respect. I had no say in the matter. You abandoned me. I gave up on you in the comfort that at least one of my children would make it. It's not too late, Father. We're still the children of Hemlock. Right now, you're nothing but a defiler. A traitor of what the purifiers fight for. Alas. Struggling for survival is a vain endeavor in the light of what awaits us all. And yet... I can't stand idly by witnessing my only legacy that matters getting its head chopped off. Justicar, free the prisoners. Grand Inquisitor? Listen carefully. You may not comprehend my actions, but such is certain. Only enslavement awaits you if you share the path of the Brotherhood. Turn back now while you still have each other. Find a quiet place to live on. Forget this life. You may taste an ephemeral peace in the next. I followed you despite the most terrible odds, sir. Everyone in this army has the utmost respect for you. But you know as well as I do that these two are traitors of the Republic. The penalty for their crimes is death. Free the prisoners. This is treason! My men and I will not betray what the Purifiers stand for, so that your little protégés get another chance, Grand Inquisitor. They die now. Stand down, Justicar. Stand down, Justicar! Soldiers, arrest and disarm the Justicar! He shall be put to trial for insubordination. Soldiers! Your judgment is clouded by your love for them. Everyone can see that. Soldiers, secure the Grand Inquisitor. I am relieving you of your command, sir. The Senate will be informed of your weakness, and you shall be dealt with accordingly. These two, however, will die this day. My axe! This is your last chance to enjoy a life far from pain. Seize it! What's going on? Wait, listen. Something is approaching. Get in formation! Formation! Protect the railguns! What are these things? The cult of the Aberrant. He's with them? Why is he with them? Stay on me. 
I've got your back, brother. No matter the odds. I want railguns on the two traitors. I want them dead. Purity and sacrifice. <laughs> to break our ranks! Stand fast! Close ranks! Soldiers! You are soldiers of the purifiers! Fight to the last! Purity and sacrifice! I'm being overwhelmed! I'm not sure that's for the best. We're on our own now. I'm getting a strong battle of high peak deja vu here. Not a good time to be reminiscing. Keep hacking! Damn you traitors! You corrupted Hemlock and unleashed doom on us all! I need more power. Justice shall be done! Drive my blade through your corrupted heart! he finally shuts up. He was doing what he thought was right. As long as he does it in silence, I'm fine with that. Still alive. We bid thee welcome, guests. 
Ugh, we forgot one. What are you supposed to be? Let me pull its head off. Wait, it speaks. This what one's different. To be? Is it mimicking you? Learning. We would be honored to have you in our domain. To know more about what are you supposed to be. No, 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 that's not quite right. Anyway, we're just humans. Nothing fancy. You already had plenty of those fleeing in your direction. They are humans. She is human. You are unknown. You are precious. Precious to us. And I'm not? Charming. Well, Elise is not trying to kill us. Apologies for the misunderstanding. We will cease your existences. But we are your host and you are our guests. Come, enter our domain, for it is full of wonders. Charming. Is it making fun of me? I'm not even sure. Let me tell you right now that I'm not comfortable entering that creature's domain. This is the way to Cordonon, and we still have to find the first piece of the Helion. We knew that the cult of the Aberon destroyed the city, so buckle up, Val, as we're going that way. I had no plans to turn back. Hemlock is this way, and I want answers. Is he working for those guys? Maybe the Lambak knows. After all, Hemlock summoned it. That's... unreal. I feel like we know nothing about Hemlock anymore. If that was even him.